Maga Genan, yes, this is an important video right here. Now, we go get into this so-called NASA with their new so-called testing a 25 engine right here that they say. A RS-25 engine that they're testing right here. And a lot of people don't understand. This is what they use to make the rain. This is what they use to manipulate the weather right here. And I already told you about the NASA launches. All of them is to manipulate the weather. Nobody going to space. The people just dumb. We go take a look at this right here and see what they're talking about. As you can see, the NASA so-called. This is a damn, this is a damn rocket right here so-called. What is this they're showing you right here, people? You believe that this is a rocket engine? The people just stupid right here. This is to manipulate the weather right here. Take a look. And every time they have a NASA launch, if you know this is bad weather, the people don't pay attention to nothing. All of this shit that you see them doing right there is making clouds. It's going to go all the way to the sky and turn into rain clouds. Take a look at this right here, people. How many years ago I did this video and show you and said, what the fuck is this? This is rain clouds right there. They're manipulating God, weather, and earth. NASA, that's all they do. They can't go to space. And as you look up, you can see the blue sky. And from the other day, I've been trying to tell you that's not the real blue sky. That's another shade over the blue. You see how it look pale blue, powder looking blue? That's not the sky, people. And a bright day, the sky look almost like a crystal kind of blue. A bright blue. You don't understand, people. A bright blue, when you look at it, you can see the reflection. No lie. And take a look at the sky now. Remember, I tell you, and I'm going to show you what they do later on in this video. How they get the sky to be semi-blue. You understand that smoky looking blue is not the real sky color. They cover it with a glare. And watch this right here. Look what they're doing. The people not even thinking and using their brain. What do you think cast those clouds? NASA is, a, is just disturbing the damn weather and the rain. You understand? That's what they do. Manipulating everything that God put on earth. That's what they're doing right here. What do you think when you see this right here, people? You believe it's an engine test? Then you're stupid. What kind of engine test would they doing right here? You're testing an engine and the shit not moving? It's nothing but bullshit. There you go right there. It's just to make rain clouds on the masses. Can you see it, people? Yes, and this one right here somewhere. I think in Mississippi right here. They're playing with the dumb masses. Watch that. What do you think that is? Bam. Mm -hmm. This Take a is look. the shuttle's fuel tank. Mm -hmm. It may only be 130 miles to space, but to cover you that... hear that, people? 130 miles to space. What a dumb shit, people. That's retarded. Wow. I told you you shouldn't believe in these sodomites. You believe that, people? <laughs> The dome is not that far away, and I already told you they can't go to it. Just wake your ass up. Since the mm -hmm. engines will use half a million gallons of fuel. Do you hear that, people? That make you know that it's stupid shit. Half a million gallon of fuel, all in this shit right here. Wow, the people just stupid. That's what's in the rocket, all fluid. <laughs> wow, this is a joke right here. As I break down the so-called Challenger. And show you, I reposted the video not too long ago. But the so-called NASA Challenger that explode, you believe that the half a million tons of fluid in there? Half a million gallon of fluid? <laughs> wow. You gotta be kidding me, people. You believe that you're stupid? And that works mm -hmm. out at two feet to the gallon. Wow, two feet per gallon, people. Two feet per gallon. Wow, you believe that, people? They don't even have nothing called rocket fluid. You better wake your ass up. They don't have no rocket fluid. It's just a fake shit for the dumb people. There you go right there. Mm-hmm. 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 See? <laughs> See? Despite the cost, however, NASA does need to test these engines once in a while. Why? So Why? What do you mean test the engine? You see, people? This is two years ago, and take a look. It's the same thing that I just showed you that NASA recently doing right now. Releasing these clouds right here, these smoke. <laughs> wow, this is a joke and you're testing an engine. Wow, come on. This place in the mm -hmm. wetlands of Mississippi. There you go. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. The 
first thing they installed was a huge loudspeaker mm -hmm. through which they played white noise to simulate the sound of a rocket. Wow. You see that, people? White noise to simulate the sound of a rocket. I already told you the rocket shit is a hoax, people. 100% in. You're talking about all that tons of rocket fluid, half a million. Wow, that's just dumb for the dumb masses, man. Why do you believe in that shit? Wake your ass up. They then sent a number of trucks in different directions mm -hmm. out into the wilderness. Uh -huh. And the drivers were ordered to stop when the noise levels became acceptable. Wow. This mm -hmm. gave them an mm -hmm. imaginary boundary line. And mm -hmm. anyone living on the inside of it was mm -hmm. offered a simple choice. Mm -hmm. Stay and you'll never hear another television program as long as you live. Wow. I'll take the NASA shilling. Wow. And get out. Wow. Mm -hmm. Pay attention right here. Mm -hmm. No one stayed. And NASA ended Look up... Look at the sky, people. Look at the sky. And I already told you, even those planes that you see, leave those streaks. That's what it turned to clouds. I already show you in my video. Break it down and show you that that's what actually caused those storms. Wake your ass up, exactly people. Come on. Mm -hmm. 125,000 acres mm -hmm. of nothing. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. They even had to move five cemeteries because wow. the noise they were planning on making would <laughs> wake the dead. They like to mock the damn people. That's what you need to know. Mm -hmm. Look at this shit right here, people. What is that? Engine test my ass. What is that? Wow. Mm -hmm. uh, don't worry if you can't hear what I'm saying. Mm -hmm. um, I couldn't even myself mm -hmm. this is the loudest sound you could possibly wow. conceive and wow. as it turns out the cleanest mm -hmm. the cleanest <laughs> the people don't get it man i'm <laughs> i'm gonna break down some things and show you man because this right here should have tell you something when you see nasa show this on tv when you see them show this on tv if you have any kind of brain it will snap in your head right away what the fuck that is right there that's cloud. They're making clouds right here, people. What's wrong with you? You can't see it? <laughs> now, the most amazing thing is that that cloud up there, mm -hmm. which was generated by the engine, mm -hmm. is just a mixture of hydrogen and oxygen. Mm -hmm. it's water. You hear that, people? It's a mixture of hydrogen and oxygen. The water vapor. The same thing they call the so-called chemtrails. What I don't tell you, people. Remember, these people know what the elements do. They know what the, what the naturality of the earth do. All they have to do, these so-called scientists, all they have to do is just use something in there that's that going to give you some kind of reaction. You understand what I mean? They already know everything works. So they know if they let go certain type of, some, some kind of this smoke right here, or whatever they call it, these clouds right here, they know exactly what it's going to do when it mix with the air. You understand me? Yes, they know people. That's the one that they call science. You understand? They figure this shit out and they use it to manipulate the weather. That's it. Vapor. Mm -hmm. And in about an hour's time, See? someone in Mississippi is going to get wet washing. It will actually rain. Bam. You hear that, people? And I told you, this is not even the clip I was talking about when I tell you that I've seen it because they was talking about the ones that they're doing today. <laughs> they was talking about the ones that they're doing today the so-called engine test nasa engine test and they mentioned that it's rain clouds that gonna fall rain and the people don't believe it there you go right there remember i did a video showing you them calling out china that china manipulating the weather making rain and even make it snow there you go right here people now you know there you go it can rain mm -hmm. what you think i told you what you think? It's raining. What you think, people? Only if you're dumb, you couldn't see that with your own eyes. You don't have to wait on these people to tell you. You use your brain. Bam. Three, mm -hmm. two, one, zero. It's a lift off. Take a look at this shit right here, people. About lift off. Take a look at this shit right here. If you have any brain, you will figure it out. What they doing right here? You think Artemis they're going to one, space? Lift off from launch pad mm -hmm. 39B at NASA's mm -hmm. Kennedy. 39B and take a look at that. That's CGI. Just wake your ass Space up. Center in Florida. Mm -hmm. 
with 8.8 .8 million pounds of thrust mm -hmm. of course you know. the most powerful rocket in the world mm -hmm. our space launch look at this shit right here people it's cgi the whole thing a camera dead on in the sky waiting to take it it's just cgi everything they give you look at the ground wow the people space stupid launch system rocket mm -hmm. sls the uncrewed flight will be the first mm -hmm. integrated test of SLS. Our mm -hmm. new Orion spacecraft and exploration ground systems at Kennedy. Mm -hmm. Artemis one. Kennedy is 33 in numerology. They have a, another one called Johnson Space Center. That's also 33 in numerology. Send Orion mm -hmm. beyond the moon, 280,000 wow. miles from Earth. There you go, people. That's where the moon at. 280,000 miles from Earth. You believe that? You're dumber than a box of rocks, people. Are you believe you believe this shit? <laughs> wow, the sun not even that far away if you want to be real. Everything is under the dome in the sky. Other than mm -hmm. any human spacecraft has ever flown. Mm -hmm, of course. This is mm -hmm. not NASA doing it. Watch this. him. You see the hand sign? It's not NASA doing it. What is that on your shirt? Wow, I told your people and the big old permit right there with this with the serpent slash to is it. The United States of mm -hmm. America doing this, see? this program, the Artemis program? They all the same. They are all the same. It's called a government operation. They're working on the dumb people brain. And there are mm -hmm. companies all across our country that mm -hmm. have a part in it. So there is really? kind of this wave of excitement being generated mm -hmm. just by saying we're going back to the moon. Wow, we're going back to the moon. The only thing they can show you is this fancy object that they made. Most of it on the computer, people. None of it is real. After wow, look at this shit right here. Computer generated. That's all it is. The rocket mm -hmm. separates from Orion. The mm -hmm. upper stage will deploy small satellites over several days. Small satellites. What the fuck is satellites? <laughs> the people just stupid. You believe that shit? Small satellite. What did they show you? Solar panel, people. You dumb or what? Perform science experiments and mm -hmm. technology demonstrations. It's bullshit. Orion will make its multi-day outbound trip to the moon, mm -hmm. propelled by a service module provided wow. by the European... All trick with the people. How can these shits fly by themselves and go to a destination? Are you stupid with nobody in there? You think they can remote control something in space? The space that they tell you about, out of this art, you believe they got connection over there, people? A lot of places on earth don't have no connection. No signal at all. Are you kidding me? And you can get signal in space? Wow, this is dumb right here, people. Stupid. Will test Orion systems on the way to the moon. Mm -hmm. Then Orion Look will at this shit right here, people. The same shit they show you for real is the same thing they show you in the computer graphic because it's all computer generated. You get this? This is dark shit that they show you that tell you it's the moon. Do you ever see the moon and it's dark? The moon is a light, people. Don't be dumb. 60 miles above the lunar surface. Wow. Using the moon's gravity and there you go. The, the moon got gravity also. And there you go with the fake earth peeping out right there. Why they do that to you? Because you're dumb. This is programming for the masses and I already told you. You're under that damn spell. You think you can get out? Dumb on. There you go. Mm -hmm. Now you know why After you're in a brainwash. A and a total distance mm -hmm. of over Look a at this shit. Over oh, a million miles, people. Something that's a million miles away. These fuckers control it. They can get back data from it. They, how did they do that, people? In the middle of nowhere. Are you kidding me? The way they describe space, he couldn't even carry no signal, people. He can't carry signal. The way they tell you, describe space is a vacuum. How can a vacuum carry signal, people? It's dumb. Or return home. There you go. You see, it's bullshit. All programming for the dumb masses. You see the sky, the blue sky? You can't go to it. What's wrong with you? And when they show you that they're in space, they never show you the blue sky. When you're in space, you can see all the way in the earth. See water, see land and everything. And when you're on the earth, you can't see out the blue sky to see space. Ensure wow. Safely Look at this Earth dumb shit. Look at that right there, people. It's the same thing they show you and tell you it's real. It's all computer graphics. Nothing real when it comes to NASA. Yes. Nothing. We do, we'll be nothing at all, people. 100% nothing. You want to do your homework? Just check. Nothing is real. Nothing. Our mm -hmm. for sustainable there you go. Mm -hmm. us for missions farther into there the you go, people. Look at these shits right here. Just solar panel floating around. You believe they make this big old metal object to float around in the middle of nowhere? Space is a fantasy where everything fly. You're dumb to believe in it. Rocks flying, people flying, everything fly. It's a fantasy land. It don't exist.
Come on. Mm -hmm. There you go. Mm -hmm. Even Moon Rock. That's how dumb you are. And this is dumb right here, people. And the people don't understand. The reason why they put black people, bam, in NASA is to get black people interested in it. They show you a woman and say, oh, this one break ground. First black woman in NASA. Uh, bam, it's dumb shit. You stupid fuck. Why you think they have to give you black people in it? Because they're selling the dumb shit to black people. Also, oh, somebody challenged me with that shit. That to show you it's work. It work 100%. Because you, dis you, you, you believe in that shit so much. You buy the idol. You buy the sodomite that they give you because it's black. Oh yes, it went to space. So it break ground. You're stupid and a motherfucker. Now you believe in space. You don't even get the fucking shit. Now you believe in space because they give you a black person in there. All of them is fucking fakers. All of them. The get your so ugly ass said, out of here. You look like a rusty man. Bam. Mm -hmm. You see the eagle on the clothing? The eagle is Freemasonry. That's all you need to know. The eagle is Freemasonry, people. Don't be dumb. This is another faker right here. You think it's real? You think you can go to fucking space in a suit? A body suit that don't even fit on your body with a glass helmet. You stupid people in a rocket. Get the fucking gateway. ass out of here. And there you go. Mm -hmm. Gateway. Gateway. They're fooling the dumb masses. Mm -hmm. Look at this shit right here that they're showing the masses. If you can't make computer graphic, you can't work at NASA. Move. Our mm -hmm. Ames Research Center in California mm -hmm. is... Take a look at this right here, people. They're going to send this to space. This is a satellite. Look at these little tiny little thing, people. The, the so-called solar panel. Look what all it together. Are you stupid? You believe you can send this up in the sky to fly around forever with no nothing, no maintenance, nothing, just flying around. The people stupid Final to believe in satellites. Mm -hmm. Look at it, the people. Is one of Look at it, people. Payload. Look at it, people. Look how delicate it is. Look how frail it is. And it gonna fly? <laughs> the people is stupid. I guess space is so soft. You don't even get no reaction. You can fly a thousand, two thousand miles per hour and no reaction. You, you're kidding me or what, people? What is it pushing on? If there's something there for it to push on, there's something there to break that fucking shit off. How dumb can you be? You believe that this can fly for real? Thousands of miles per hour? Targeted for launch on the uncrewed Artemis Look at this shit. It's fakery, people. <laughs> Wow, I tell you, man, that's why they give you a pandemic. You're too dumb. To the there you go. All fake shit. And Orion mm -hmm. Everything they show you is computer graphic. Every damn thing. You just have to have brain. Nothing real in NASA. Nothing Fire at all. Wow, six month investigation. Wow, people. How do they, con how they control them? <laughs> it's in the middle of nowhere, people. Anywhere in the world that's undeveloped, you never get signal there. They don't have no, they don't have no antennas, no, no cell towers. You never get no signal there. Period, people. If they don't run no wires for you to get no signal, you never get no signal there. What kind of wires is running these shits flying around in space? And I already told you, you can't have a flying modem. The modem is what distributes the internet. You can't get it to fly. Got a boat down somewhere with wires to it. Then it sent off the wireless signal. How did they get signal in space, people? That dumb. And look at the sun that they show you right here. Something that's so-called burning forever and can't stop burning. The same, the same type of heat coming off it right round the clock. There you go, the sun. Still burning. Just some gas burning. You're dumb or what? The people just retarded. And I'm going to get into the so-called Bill Gates talking about he gonna blanket the sun for so-called global warming and i'm gonna show you some things let it run i who made billions mm -hmm. out of creating super mm -hmm. funky corporate mm -hmm. software mm -hmm. dimming the sun and a lot of people not gonna get this the reason why i was showing you the blue sky powder looking blue and tell you that the real blue of the sky wasn't like that if you can go back find some pictures with you outside and you got a picture, a, a shot of the sky. Take a look at it then and take a look at it now and see what's the difference. I already told you it's never looked the real blue again. So they're telling you that this sodomite right here, the Bill Gates, has sell you the virus and the vaccine. He's going to send some balloons up there in the sky to basically block the sun. But they're talking about...
basically do a little mist that gonna cover the whole sky gonna give you a layer over the sky people another layer bam it happened already they already did it people wow but pay attention right here this is all you know they already did it now they're pointing it on this character right here which i told you it's a government front but i told you people they already do it take a look at the sky your eyes is a proof like i don't tell you if you can remember some years ago maybe maybe 2000 in the early 2000s or so and you look at the sky take a look at the sky now and take a look at it then if you have a shot at it and you can tell it's not the same blue the same thing that they tell you that this bill gates gonna do they already did it they already did it people to hide the sky from the people and everything you never understand let it run mm -hmm. bill gates doesn't think of himself that mm -hmm. way Mm -hmm. Bill Gates doesn't think of himself as some guy who got super rich mm -hmm. making bad software. See? Bill Gates thinks of himself as mm -hmm. God. You see, this is mockery right here. He look at himself like God. The same people put on the Bill Gates, put on the Sodomite. And this is all you have to get the truth. It's not conspiracy. The same people put on this Tucker character, let him on TV, let the dumb people get to know him. It's the same people put on the Bill Gates. They're all about the agenda, pushing this dumb shit on the masses for the new world order. Like I don't tell you, the reason why this Saddamite gonna come and try to so-called expose Bill Gates because it's not about Bill Gates. The world government already did it. They already blanket the sky. Take a look at it with your own eyes. In control of the solar system. Mm -hmm. And that's why Bill Gates is now backing something called sun dimming technology. Mm -hmm. They say backing it, people. They say backing it. He's not the so-called operator of it, but he backing it. Backing it and then who was the one who bringing it for the Bill Gates to back it? The world government, people. The world government. That's what they do. And like I said, they already did it. Don't be dumb. They already blanket the sky. Sunlight out mm -hmm. of the Earth's atmosphere wow. causing global cooling. Mm -hmm. Wow. It got nothing to do with non-global cooling. The global warming is a 100% hoax. You understand that? It's not a joke. It's a hoax. No doubt about it. So what they're doing with the so-called blanket of the sky? I already told you they did it already. That's why the sky look powder looking blue instead of that bright blue that will shock your eyes. You remember when you're back in the days when you look at the sky, you don't have to look up at the sun. Once it's a bright day, it basically you can feel it in your eyes, the brightness of the damn sky. Now you don't see it no more, people. <laughs> The blanket already gone. They already did it. That's why they're calling out the Bill Gates. <laughs> they're going to tell you, no, we're not going to let him do it. But it's already done. That's not fraught with risks. <laughs> you thought gain-of-function research mm -hmm. on pathogens was mm -hmm. dangerous. Mm -hmm. Try that. But Playing that is the top the Harvard University. Mm -hmm. Its scientists are testing that technology mm -hmm. by spewing calcium carbonate dust into the atmosphere. You hear that, people? Uh -uh. And what do you think they're doing with those fake volcanoes? <laughs> don't worry about it i got the volcano thing covered i'll get on it later on i will just drop a video about it later on but what do you think they're doing with those fake volcanoes i already told you there's no melted rocks just wake your ass up bill gates is backing <laughs> the first high altitude mm -hmm. experiment of one radical climate change solution mm -hmm. he's just backing it <laughs> okay massive chemical watch this. cloud that could watch this it's called solar geoengineering watch this, and it's people. highly controversial watch this people they already did it <laughs> wow <laughs> I tell you, all you need to do is pay attention. They already did it, people. The sky is already blanket. The powder blue is not the real sky color, people. It's not. That kind of look, kind of smoky looking blue is not the real sky. And another thing, people, I got a video I'm going to make about the timing and all the speeding up the time and everything. But look where the sun set. I'm begging you, people, use your eyes. Look where the sun set nowadays. It don't all the way go over the so-called horizon. It's set right there. It's not, just pay attention to the sun, people. And you can tell that they're tampering with everything. They put a shade over the sky. 100% in. It's already done. There you it go. It looks something like this. There you Thousands go. Thousands of planes would fly very high you and see? use nozzles to inject millions of tons. <laughs> the same thing they do to control the damn weather. What I tell you, the same thing they do with the chemtrail, people. That's how they do it. Like I don't tell you. They have some things already figure out. And like I tell you, if you mix certain things with the element, you can get a, a certain kind of reaction, people. And that's what they're doing. They know already. 
You don't get it? Pay attention here. They already did this. This already done. The whole wide world already get this already. I know for sure that it's in America. It's already covered. Wow, people, it's already done. Light reflecting particles into the stratosphere. It would create a thin chemical cloud of those particles. There you go. It's already done, people. All long ago, I've been talking about this shit. I keep telling you, look at the sky and it already changed. There you go. There they go. They tell you right here. It's already done, people. The Bill Gates is just a front. They're going to tell you, oh, no, he don't run the world. We can't let him do this. Da, 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 da. But it's already done. They pump, pump fake the people into believe that it's the Bill Gates going to do it. But they already did it. After they did it, they bring it to your attention. Bam! The whole planet, there you go. Some sunlight from reaching the surface. Mm -hmm. It would mimic a giant volcanic eruption, <laughs> which we know. There you go, and they mention the fucking giant volcano eruption. Well, I don't tell you, people. This play a big part in it, in blocking out the sky. Just remember that I tell you, whatever shit they explode right here, and send it off is the flames and the, the flumes. And the dust or whatever gonna go up to the sky and make that blanket a cloud. The earth. Just like I show you. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Bill Gates is not God. You see? Bill Gates you see? is some kind of mm -hmm. weird, socially mm -hmm. awkward rich guy who mm -hmm. lives in Seattle. He no, it's a government puppet, but you would never tell the people that. You wanna push them more deeper into conspiracy. You would never tell the people the truth. The truth is, Bill Gates work for the government. The people are trying to destroy everybody on the earth. That's who he work for. That's why he's serving up the vaccine. And I already told you, the sky blanket had already happened. Don't fool the masses. We've seen it. Own the planet, mm -hmm. but he's now mm -hmm. changing the planet mm -hmm. single-handedly. This is mm -hmm. not just over his mm -hmm. yard in he's Seattle. This is over your mm -hmm. yard. How and could he do that? How could he do that? How could he do that? This is American right here. He can't go to some other country and say, we go blanket the sky. No. What, what, what would that look like? I already told you, he not gonna do shit. It's a government operation. They already did it. This is just a front. And the mm -hmm. whole planet. Mm -hmm. Now, according to Forbes, Frank mm -hmm. Kutch, who's the project's top mm -hmm. investigator, quote, does not know what the results might bring. Mm -hmm. Just experiment with the globe. We know what it is gonna bring. It's already happened. And if you take a look at China, when they tell you that China is polluted, that you can almost see the fog right there over the horizon, Right there at the damn skyscrapers and everything. What the fuck you think that is? They're the one who do it. Just in case you don't know that secret. They're the one who doing it. All that so-called pollution in China is no pollution. It's them do it. They blanket off the fucking sky so the people can't see it. And like I don't tell you, the truth is in the sky. But hold on. That's a good place to bring you the lie. You're going to see the signs and the wonders that they created right there in the sky. And of course, they can't do it with the day just bright and you see the real sky. They have to dim it, cover it up and everything. And of course, when you're going to get your alien invasion and everything, they're going to blanket the sky real dark. I told you already, it's all government operation and the people. Nothing really happening naturally in these times. All controlled by the world government. I'm gone.